Welcome back. Uh, will it be France or will it be Croatia? One of the nations will lift the World Cup uh, tomorrow evening. And excitement is at fever pitch ahead of the big final. Here in South Africa, fans of both nations are gearing up for the showdown. Joining me now are Croatian fans, Ivan and Ivan, uh, Ivan Obadic and Ivan Ostoya. Welcome, gentlemen. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Very thank excited you. to be here. Let's first yeah. start with uh, a little background on, on uh, the both of you. You from from here. You your heritage and and that kind uh, of thing. I'm actually out of all guys here. I'm the only original one. I would like to say original one. I <laughs> came here in '98. Yes. I moved in '98. I started my family here in '98. Yes. My wife's also Croatian, but born here. Uh, kids born here. Uh, so I'm the yeah 20 years 20 years the later real I'm thing. still here real thing <laughs> and uh, even even Oster, yeah. hey, Ivan, my, my father was born in Croatia in a little island called Kočina, in a village called Blato, and he moved here long ago. And now we've we've been born here in South Africa, me and my brother. And uh, yeah, but dry hard Croatians, we go every year to Croatia on holiday. Our holiday homes in Croatia, and yeah, that's our that's our second second home. Give us a sense of, of the cultural aspect of, of Croatia and why they have cer certainly seemed so determined at this World Cup. Uh, look, from, from my side, look, we, we all know what happened in the past, recent past, 25, 30 years ago, and, and Croatia went through the, through the hell. And, uh, and the, I'd say, and a lot of these guys that are playing at the moment, I think that's one of the reasons why they do so well. A lot of them, a lot of them went through the, through the hell during the war. They've been refugees and been uh, chased from their uh, uh, homes, and 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 these things do something to you that that you de that you decide to fight that you that you like never give up and you can see on uh, these last couple of three yeah. four games. I mean, uh, everybody thinks they're done and they come back and they keep coming back, and the same with the uh, same with the coach as well because he went through the similar similar experiences like most of these top players. And uh, and uh, although we were we were in the World Cups, uh, the, all this competition prior to pr this one, it seems like something just clicked between coach and the players, and they all think the same way. And and I, I think that's why we, that's why we're performing the way we're performing. We all know as fans when you are rooting for your favourite team, there's always nervous tension. At which point did uh, you, for example, feel that this team is going to go far? From the beginning? From the or? beginning. From the beginning, we back crashed from the beginning. Remember, 20, 20, 20 years ago, Croatia got to the quarterfinals, beat Germany 3-0. It was on my 21st birthday party. It was a crazy night. Same thing this year, my 41st birthday party. <laughs> Croatia beat, go through to the semis. So, yeah, yeah it was, it's, a great, it's a great vibe. The Croatian churches, the Croatian community, going crazy. They're loving, they're loving soccer. And, and, it started, and it started from the first game. I mean, we had the first yeah. game. We organized, we organized these gatherings. And, and the... And the, and the Unity and uh, and the excitement that these events brought to all community. I mean, every time there's more people coming, and and, and next time you expect 200, 250, 300 people comes. Let's just look at. Uh, is it possible for you to single out one or two highlights, the both of you so far of the performances? Oh, never give up. Eh? The guys just don't give up. I mean, and that one goal in, from Modric uh, in the group phase. I uh, was Argentina. Yeah, yeah. I was like, wow. I pushed it in there. Remember, Rakitic is our man, eh? Number seven, he's named, we named after him, Ivan Rakitic. <laughs> we are, he's, our, he's our player. He's my player, my first, number one. Then Modric is number two. Now they're all done. No, we got it, guys. I mean, uh, the, you, can see, you can see the unity in this team. And it just, the guy died for one another, you know? Is fatigue a consideration, seeing that they're coming from three consecutive they, they matches? Said, they said yes, but I don't think so. Because, uh, because I've been uh, reading a lot of, a lot of uh, articles from the, from the coach and stuff. And when he says, please, uh, who, who, needs, who, who wants to come out? No, I can do it. I'll, I'll stay, I'll play. Each one of them. Even they can hardly move. Let's look at what Croatia needs to do to be victorious tomorrow against France. Look, in my opinion, we shouldn't concede like we concede against the English. If we, if we don't concede, First 30, 40 minutes, I think we'll take it. And you, sir? I think, I think if France gets one goal, it's going to make Croatia stronger. We're going to chase harder. You know, the first person, in my, in my opinion, the first team that scores the first goal, they have, they're going to defence mode. They stop, they stop attacking, and that's when Croatia's stronger. They just keep attacking, 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 and that's why we beat England the way we did. OK, we wish you well. Let's just, before you go, where will you be watching the match tomorrow? And is everyone invited? Tomorrow we're at the, the Croatian... Church, it's called the church, but we've got a, a hall there that we have our festivals all the time. And it's at 99 Central Avenue in Hutton. 
And yeah, there's, uh, there's, people are coming. So if he wants to join us, they can join us. I'm sure the priest won't mind. And the bigger the merrier. That's it. The party's happening there. I mean, we've been, we've been watching each and every game there so far. Tomorrow we're planning a big one. Are we expecting four, five hundred people? We have a little bit more to the fan club yeah, that is just going hey. to support us. Wrap it up for us. And, uh, yeah. Do you guys have a little Croatia chant for us before we let yes. you go? Okay. Mi smo Hrvati i bit ćemo Hrvati. Hrvatsko! Hrvatsko! Awesome. That was uh, Croatian fans, Ivan Obedic and Ivan Ostoja. Uh, just uh, letting us know who the winner will be tomorrow. It's the 2018 World Cup final between Croatia and uh, France. Uh, you, there are no prizes for guessing where their money will be and who they are supporting. Get yourself to the Croatian Church. It's going to be a festival of note. That's where we leave your sport for now. Don't go away. <laughs>